Okay, guys, I'm going to start a new video tonight with opening Scott's package, and then we'll continue the video tomorrow, okay, because the Costco video is going up right now. So, Scott sent me a package. I have scissors. I'll be careful. I don't want to cut anything. Okay. What do we got in here? <laughs> okay, Sandy, let me see what I got in here. What do we got? Oh, this must be for Nate. <laughs> I'll show him he's just getting out of the shower. What are you doing, Sam? He got a pet, but he collects these. What do we got here? Looks like we got some stuff. <laughs> oh my goodness, you guys. <laughs> I've never seen some more jelly bellies. <laughs> Have you guys ever seen more jelly bellies? What? Would you stop, Sandy? You wouldn't take them outside. You wouldn't need one. What have we got in here? <laughs> I have not. I have. I've not bought any jelly beans since Easter. So these are going to be well. Tasting good. <laughs> I have not bought any jelly beans. Oh, these are so good. The classic jelly beans with branches, bracks. People get mad because I pronounce it wrong. Bracks. <laughs> oh, I haven't had a jelly bean since Easter. <laughs> That's my favorite flavor. He knows it. And you can't just buy them here. You can't buy them. Oh. Have you, if you never tried butter popcorn um, jelly beans, you got to try them. I'm telling you. I know it sounds weird, but they're so good. I got my fix of jelly beans. <laughs> I have not thought of jelly beans since Easter. What's this? What? <laughs> Swedish fish jelly beans? What? I got... <laughs> oh my god, I gotta try one. I have to try one of these. I need a pair of scissors, darn it. I got 50 pairs and they're always disappearing. Swedish fish jelly beans, okay? Who doesn't love Swedish fish? Oh! Yum! Oh my god, Scott. Thank you so much. You know how much I love jelly beans. I knew you were sending me some. I think it was this kind you showed me. I can't remember. But I knew it. So I said, I'm not buying any, any jelly beans until I get the ones from Scott. <laughs> I'm a jelly bean freak. I love jelly beans. Get out. We got a little girl. <laughs> Does she look like me or what? We're twinsies. We are twinsies. <laughs> she <got> glasses. <laughs> oh my gosh. We're twinsies. <laughs> oh, let's see your name. There it is. What's your name? Coral. Coral! <laughs> Zen, did you come to see Coral? Look at! Look at Coral! 
Oh, did she she look like Mama? He's right here. Look at him. You come for a jelly bean, you're not getting any. You've been trying to eat my pencils. Oh my gosh, Coral. <laughs> we look like twinsies. <laughs> oh my gosh. What is this? Oh, I broke. But that's okay, Scott. We got good glue. He, he showed me this. He showed me the chicken trophy. Winner, winner. And I told him, every week I'm going to pick a, a chicken of the week and they're going to get the trophy. I can glue it. No problem, Scott. No problem. We got some crazy glue. Glue. I'll get Bruce to glue it. Because if I glue it, I'll get my fingers stuck together. I know it. I can't wait to sit here and have some jelly beans tonight. Oh my god. Mmm. Mmm. -mm. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. <laughs> Looks like he sent Bruce some cookies. <laughs> I bet these are for Bruce. He'll have the whole bag eaten. Oh. Ten individual bags. He'll bring them to work with him. These are his favorite cookies. <laughs> what is this? Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't think there was a card and I found it at the bottom. Let me open the card. Oh, look at the puppies. <laughs> look at the puppies. <laughs> oh, Scott, you don't have to do this. <laughs> Michelle, hello. I wanted to send you some summer jelly bean bellies and your favorite popcorn. The target bird looks like you if you were a bird. <laughs> I thought the same thing. It looks like me. That is me. If I was a bird, that would be me. <laughs> and the trophy for chicken of the week. I can't wait. I can't wait. I seen somebody else haul this. Before uh, Scott got it. I didn't tell him I wanted it. I did not tell him. I, said, I did not say I wanted it. And he, he just knew. And when I seen it on somebody's haul, I thought, if I could get a hold of that, I could ha I could do chicken of the week and they could get a trophy. And I found the chalkboard. I don't, I, I found it, oh, it, it used to be on the bottom of Zen's cage. It's a chalkboard. Uh, we used to sit the cage on top of it. And I put the chalkboard in the yard, in the chicken yard. You know, right? Who's chicken of the week on the chalkboard? But I gotta get chalk. That's what I gotta get. I gotta get some chalk. <laughs> I ate a whole bag of the Swedish fish, Swiss jelly, Swedish fish jelly beans in one day. They were so good. I've never seen these in, ever. I've never seen them. They are so good. I love jelly beans, and these ones, they taste like Swedish fish. They taste less like it, but in jelly bean form. <laughs> I wanted to send a pass for Nate and Bruce his favorite cookies. I hope you enjoyed the keychain. Oh, a magnet from Domingo in Vegas, Las Vegas. Thank you for being an amazing friend. Love, Scott. <laughs> well. You are an amazing friend, and you're just so kind to me. I don't know how to thank you. Let's look at... Uh, I was telling him when he was in Vegas, I seen... Uh, in the brass ground, I seen, I seen he was by the flamingo. <laughs> Oh, 
And I said to Scott, is that the flamingo you're buying? He said, yes. I said, when my mom took me on a trip, to, me and my brother on a trip to Vegas, after my dad passed, we were always there for her help and her and that, and she wanted to repay us. So she said, I want to take you on a trip to Vegas, because they, her and my dad loved to go to Vegas. They went once or twice a year, and they always stayed at the Flamingo, and she brought me to the Flamingo, and I was like, oh, it was the best trip of my life. I had such a good time with my mom. We ate such good food. And we, we gambled, but we didn't, we're not big gamblers. We didn't, you know, go broke. At night, when we wanted to relax, we'd go down to the casino and we'd gamble. You know, we'd play the slots. Like, I don't think we paid, played any more thing bigger than a dollar. And um, it was just the best trip of my life. Like, you got to see New York City. You got to see everywhere. All there. And it just blows your mind. If you know, you know, if you've ever been to Vegas. It just blows your mind away. And it was, I'll never forget that trip. I wish I had someone to go with. To, like, a trip to Vegas. Like, Bruce, he's not much of a gambler. Like, I'm not either. But, you know, it's nice to go to the restaurants. And to go uh, down at night and do a little little slot machine. <laughs> Look at this beautiful keychain. Flamingo. And Lucky Chip 1000. <laughs> like, uh, look at this. Oh. Stop. Look at this magnet. If you don't, you don't know, like, me and my mom, before I had me, before, we got a casino downtown, but, uh, Sandy, stop! We would, before they built the casino, they had a casino boat, so we'd go, to, we'd go play the slots on the boat, Bruce would say, go ahead, like, we'd play quarters, and, or we wouldn't play. Like, we'd spend, like, $40, $50, we'd win. So we'd get to play longer. And then they built the casino. We went there. Then the old racetrack where my dad, where I grew up, where my dad worked, the horse races, they turned that into casino. We used to go there all the time. We'd go, and we'd go uh, play the slots for a few hours. Then we'd win. If we won, we'd get a little ahead. We'd go, and we'd go play bingo. Oh. I did a lot of things with my mom. A lot. Uh-huh. More than anybody else. We did a lot of things because I didn't have Nate until I was 38. And I didn't have any responsibilities in working. I was working. We didn't have kids back then, so me and my mom went everywhere. We went to uh, the casino, we played bingo, we went shopping, we went out for dinner, out for lunch. We did it all. Mm -hmm. And then when they come along, we didn't do it as much, but when he got a little older, we did it. Uh, Bruce would say, go ahead, I'll, I'll be here with Nate. Go with your mom. You want a cookie now? I don't know what you want. You got everything there. You got everything. You don't need anything else. She's got her cookie. She's got her, her chicken thing. She's got her dog food. Yeah, so this was one of the best trips of my life with my mom and my brother. Mm -hmm. We had a good time. Mm -hmm. Oh, if I could find, I got pictures. I could pull them out. I had a permanent. I had per. I went and got a perm before we went <laughs> before we went to Vegas. <laughs> And 
And when we got home, somebody broke into my mom's house where we were on vacation. Yeah, we figured it was the kid next door. Mm hmm Nobody ever broke into their house. Somebody broke into her house. Stole a bunch of stuff. Mm hmm That was sad. Oh. I'm going to be sitting here eating these all night, you know. <laughs> mm-hmm. Okay. We'll just see you like that, like a snap. We'll see you in the morning, and we'll be out walking. See you in the morning. Thanks again, Scott. I sure appreciate all this stuff. I sure do. And I'll give Nate and Bruce their stuff, too. Thank you. There's your Pez, Scott said. Oh, that's nice. Thank you, <laughs> Thank you, Scott. Yeah, Target. That's interesting. That's a store over there. No Target, Mom. Oh, you know Target? Yes. <laughs> That'd be nice for your collection. Thank you. When you clean the air fryer? Yes, because I'm heating up my food because I'm hungry. Ah. Uh, I'm still on it. Enjoy. Thanks. Hello everyone! I'm making some wraps. I was I've been out in the yard weeding for two hours. And then I thought, well, time to come in and have some lunch. Make Bruce's lunch for work. Right then I've been weeding, eh? Yeah. She's Just... been out weeding like crazy. And you know what? She was out before me. But that's what happens when you're on afternoon. And me I've been going righteously, planted all my onions. Yeah, let's hear it. Yeah. I only got a couple more things to plant, and then the greenhouse is shut down. I got to figure out where I'm going to plant my huckleberries. Hope I'm not too late. <laughs> but we don't care. Whatever we get, we get. I got a lot of plants. Do they come back every year? Do you know? I don't know. I think so. I'm not sure. They should, you would think. Almost like a raspberry. There's a couple plants out there. I planted, I only got one more flower to plant. And then they're all planted, my marigold. Good. They'll keep the pests out. I know them damn... That basil ain't going to keep them out. They eat it. Can't figure out what's eating them. They eat the basil? Yeah, they mount it. I, I thought put it said... right next to my tomato plants. Somebody said, oh, put basil. Basil is a deterrent of insects. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's not a deterrent. It's a incentive. <laughs> You should tell the person that don't... Oh, I can't read. No, it was on the internet. Yeah, well, you should leave a comment. I don't remember what I did two seconds ago. You <laughs> could eating a chicken. Mm -mm -mm. Uh-oh. You don't have to go to work today. <laughs> Hello. Okay. I got them all done, and I okay. put. If you put a little bit of uh, um, roll it up, baby. Sweet chili sauce. They taste just like McDonald's wraps, but only these. This chicken's not fried. Their chicken's fried, and this is not fried. Yeah, I'm telling you, it tastes just like. She fails to realize it's not McDonald's. It's Mama Michelle. Oh, yeah. Jeez, I hate when you do that. Oh, it's like McDonald's. No, I'm just saying. Right, sand. Steven. Okay. Bruce's lunch for work. He's got a couple of wraps, some chips. I'm going to give him some of my applesauce. He can pick out a chocolate bar he wants if he wants to bring one. Wish I could find my, my lid thing. Found it. Hear that? You know that's good. Sam, Mom got chicken for you. Hang on, we're gonna go sit down. 
and have our our lunch. I'll give them a jar today and a jar for tomorrow. Then I don't have to pack it tomorrow. There. I'm gonna go eat my my wrap, and then we're. I wanna get back out to picking picking weeds. It's my favorite pastime lately. <laughs> Look what I'm doing, you guys! Cutting this mulberry tree down. I'm all by myself. I'm doing it. Yeah. <laughs> I want the fence to go up this weekend, so I'm going to clear all this out. And let me show you over here what I did all morning. Don't mind the central air running, but I cleaned all this out. I still have to clear it up a little bit more, but the sun is out here, and I don't want to work over here while the sun's on me. But, yeah, it was covered with weeds and with Goose's junk. I told them... You don't put anything around my chicken coop and run. This is my space. Yeah. Nothing worse than a husband that collects everything. Everything. I'm slaving in the chicken yard pulling weeds. These heifers are all sitting on the deck. <laughs> Unbelievable. You could have helped you guys. A little bit. Okay, I have this natural popcorn for the girls. <laughs> Make sure you share. I did my my list for tomorrow, and it freaking blew away when I was in the house getting um, my popcorn. Son of a whipper snipper seriously I can't see it anywhere I didn't think it was that windy oh. I'm not putting the camera on me because I don't have uh, makeup on I sweat and picking weeds all day and I got a tank top on I don't want to show my fatty arms Put some uh, some seasoning on my popcorn. Sometimes I'd rather just keep the camera off me all the time. Then nobody has anything to say about me. Yeah. Here's some popcorn. I can't believe my list blew away. Where did it go? Our neighbors are getting their fence put up. You guys seen my list? Where it went? I don't even see it on the grass. Ugh, it sucks. Oh, I found it. It was flipped like this. So I thought it was gone. Gone. <laughs> what is it? <laughs> Yay! Big weekend. I got Nate and the chickens working. Okay guys, we're having Romano's cheddar pierogies tonight for dinner. 
easy meal after being outside weeding all day. Me and Nate's been going at it all day cutting weeds down. So this is what's for dinner. Just going to boil them up and then fry them in a little pan with some onion and bacon. That's it. I'll show you when I have my plate ready. Okay, guys, this is dinner tonight. We have pierogies, uh, bacon, onions, and cheese, and I got sour cream on mine. Bruce will put that on his when he eats his, but right now he's at work, so. Then we got leftovers for lunch tomorrow. So that's what's for dinner tonight. I'm going to end the video here because I'm going to go sit down and relax, have a cold pop, my dinner and watch some YouTube because I've been outside all day pulling weeds. So I hope you have a good night and we'll see you guys soon in the next one. And I want to thank Scott again for the wonderful stuff he sent me. Thanks, Scott. We'll see you guys in the next one.